What's up everyone? I am Jamie with Three Little Goats Homestead and today is an important day. Today is feed day. I know for sure I have got to get some milk replacer for Hope. We have been supplementing her with goat milk, but that is just not enough now that she's getting bigger. So now we gotta figure out all the feed that we have to get. I know I stacked up on alfalfa pellets for the goats and black sunflower seeds because last time I went to get some, they didn't have any, so we had to go to a different feed store to get them, and when they had them in stock, we grabbed a couple extra. So, let's see what else we need to get. All right, we haven't built a feeder for the cows yet, but they, yeah, definitely need cow feed. Let's see. I would probably do another chick, uh, chick starter. Let's see, rabbits. Uh, can't see in there, but rabbits are pretty good. We didn't go through a whole lot of feed. Layer pellets, probably do another bag of those. The goats, we're about halfway down, but I'm going to restock them anyway. The boys do get a pellet, but they have got plenty. And I'm just always going to assume we're going to need pig feed because why not? All right, so I have my list of everything we need. I do have to get some stuff at Tractor Supply, and the majority of our feed I get at our local feed store. So let's hop in the truck and go get some feed. If you're giving me your love, giving me your love, I know that we have as each other now. I promise I won't leave your side. I hope who I am is enough. So we have got all of the things that we need for the animals. We also have some other feed that's already over here that's going to get added. So I'll show you first off what we put in our goat rations. Everybody feeds their goats different things. It is also dependent on where you live in the country, what you're going to feed them. I find this is what works best for my girls, keeping their milk production up, especially in this heat. So it's just a matter of figuring out what works best for you. But these are the things that we put into our feed. The sound of people talking, the wind blowing in the trees. Oh, I will open up my eyes so I can see the light. Oh, and I'll try to spread my wings so I can fly. Oh, and the darkness starts to fade. Like things are gonna go my way I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day I'm gonna let the past be filled with smoke And I will try to fix what has been broken And take this weight off my shoulders Cause I know yesterday ain't coming back Gonna let the past stay in the cold I will listen to the ocean Let its unsaid words be spoken And I'll let my mind be carried by the waves Oh, I will open up my eyes so I can see the light Oh, and I'll try to spread my wings so I can fly Start 
So all of that feed filled this can completely up. And I will have a blog post with the exact rations of what we put in and a description of why we use it and what the benefits are. So be sure to check out the link down below if you want to read more about what we feed our goats. We also had to make some upgrades to our feeders. If you've been around for a while, you we have a video on how we built these gravity feeders. But the problem is Quackensteiner and Muscovy Drake, he has gotten into the habit of coming over and he learned that if he just puts his beak right here, he can push these up. So we had to put anti-theft devices on all of them so he can't push them up anymore. But other than having to add the anti-theft, these feeders are working out great still. We've had them for almost a year. We've got to build one more for the cows. We have the trash can. We just haven't actually had time to build the feeder, but so far they're all working out great. So as far as how much we actually feed our girls, now this, let me say it be very clear, this only goes to the girls. I do not feed this to my bucks. The bucks get their own special feed and they only get maybe a cup to split between the three of them a day. And we don't really even give them that much in the summertime. It's mostly in the wintertime when the pasture dies off. Now for the girls, they don't get milked in the morning, so they don't get a whole lot. They get one of these, this is the bucks, but they get one of these to split between them all. And that is it. In the evening times, it's a different story. I fill up three of those scoops and that is one for all of the girls that are still nursing and the babies. And then I use two scoops for milking. And when they're on the milk stand, they get to eat as much as they can gobble down at the time of milking. And then whatever's left will go back to the rest of the girls. All right, y'all. So it is evening chore time, if you couldn't hear in the background. So it's time to get everyone fed and milked. So Jesse's already got most of my bucket here ready to go. I've got my milker. I've got Hope's starter bottle. I've got pig feed, dog food, and I need one more thing of goat feed. Now that the goats and everybody is on the right side of the fence, no gravy. You stay. You two taters. We have to close up the gate. Well, I scratched in the dirt for a while. I gained all that I knew for a price. In the end, what I found was nowhere near as nice. No matter the rain, no matter the storm, I'm coming home, I'm coming home. Leave open the gate, don't turn off the light, I'm coming home. Though I fought with my claws and teeth. So I elbowed my way to a seat There'd be no kind of peace like you beside me No matter the rain, no matter the storm I'm coming home, I'm coming home Leave open the gate, don't turn off the light I'm coming home. I'm coming home. Nothing's as it seems in the photo. Nothing is as sweet going so long. Nowhere I can ramble or roam could change my mind. Could slow. Yeah.
storm, I'm coming home Oh, I'm coming home Leave open the gate Don't turn off the light I'm coming home I'm coming home mm -hmm. Because that's the main mission in life is to eat my camera. But that is pretty much it for today. It is about time to head inside and eat dinner. So if you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. It really does help. And if you haven't already, hi Snow, hit that subscribe button. We put out new videos every single week. And if you have any questions about any of the things that I put in my feed, I will have a link down below to a blog post about all that. But if you have any other questions, be sure to leave those down in the comments below. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. How's my elbow good? Tastes good? Is it up to your standard? <laughs> Snow. It's, it's not. Come on. Thank you. Excuse me. Oh, are you coming up too, Pip? Her pop? <laughs> my pop. You gotta come up here too. Hi.